This is Gene Key for KDD Texas News from WFAA.com and Johnson County. The U.S. Geological Survey confirmed an earthquake occurred near Claiborne just before 5 p.m. Wednesday afternoon. The 2.7 magnitude quake was about 16 miles northeast of Claiborne and 29 miles southwest of Dallas. It was a small earthquake, roughly equivalent to a construction site blast. It isn't the first time earthquakes have shaken the area, though. Claiborne experienced a series of small earthquakes in 2009 and 2010, and SMU scientists concluded that they could have been caused, in part, by a saltwater injection well. So far, Claiborne officials have released no comment on the quake. The Associated Press is reporting from McKinney. A teen has been convicted of manslaughter in the fatal beating of a Dallas-area man who argued with some youths about reckless driving in the neighborhood. The penalty phase is Thursday for 18-year-old Seth Doris of Wiley. He faces up to 20 years in prison. A judge in McKinney on Wednesday found Doris guilty for his role in the 2009 death of 28-year-old Jonathan Bird of Wiley. Investigators say Bird had exchanged words with several teens who were in the truck. The Dallas Morning News reports Doris originally was charged with murder. Three other teens charged with murder face trial next year. Another youth pleaded guilty to aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and spent more than a year in juvenile detention. Wiley is 20 miles northeast of Dallas. Retail gasoline prices rose slightly across Texas this week as the holidays approach. The weekly AAA Texas gasoline price survey released Thursday shows the price of a gallon of regular unleaded gasoline rose by an average of a penny this week. The average price remains unchanged nationally. The most expensive gasoline found in the Texas survey was in Amarillo, where the average price fell two cents per gallon to $3.16. The least expensive average retail price was found in El Paso, where it fell three cents to $3.01 per gallon. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key for KDD Texas News.